Hello, I am Rodrigo from Pax Tecnologia and I'm going to show you a short presentation of how we can log on a Windows domain using the Oracle Internet Directory as the backend to store the user's password. Okay, to get started, let's see how would you do to change a user's password. I guess there's nothing more basic than changing a password. So let's set the password to 10, 20, 30, and then we are going to use it to log on a Windows domain. So OK, next, and then next again, next, and finish. All right, now let's log on our domain using the new password, the one we have just changed using the Oracle Internet Directory Web 2. 10, 20, 30, OK. Oh great! So you could see that all we did here was integrating the Oracle Internet Directory with Samba using then to act as a domain controller, just like we are used to see with the well-known Active Directory from Microsoft. Ok, but now the big question is, how did we do that? The answer is just simple. First, we need to import Samba schema to the Oracle Internet Directory and populate user's account with the associated attributes. These are the attributes that Samba uses to authenticate. And you can see here the attributes that OID uses when we change a password. Uh, okay, we also needed to tell Samba where to look for user's information. You, here is a sample of our smb.conf. You can see that there is an LDAP suffix, an LDAP user, an LDAP group suffix, and, 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 that, and that's it. So, finally, we needed to develop an SQL plugin because Samba uses the Samba entity password and Samba LM password attributes to retrieve the user's information. But OID uses another attribute to restore the password, the ELF attribute. So, we needed to develop this SQL plugin to synchronize both attributes. Ba basically, this, w this is what our SQL plugin does. So finally, you can see a little, a little bit of the code we have developed with SQL. And that's all. Pretty easy, huh? I hope you guys enjoyed this presentation and see you next time. Bye-bye.